The tech rebound continues. The NASDAQ up another about 2.5% today amid the rotation after hitting correction territory just earlier in the week on Monday, down over 10% since the highs we saw on February 12th. The Dow was up 350 points at its high today to hit another intraday record. S&P was up 1.3% at its high. And the tech rebound that we're seeing here is really on interest rates just kind of steadying. After the 10-year interest, uh, the 10-year bond last week hit 1.62, today it was unchanged around 1.52 or so. So we're seeing it just moderate money pouring back into that tech sector. Also, the stimulus bill was signed today by President Biden. Earlier this morning, weekly jobless claims came in a little bit better than expected, 712,000 versus 725,000. And all eyes will be on PPI tomorrow and see if what kind of follow-up there is to the CPI number that we got yesterday. ES option data from yesterday, 523 total, 523,000 total options traded. 58% on the put side. So lots of call volume activity yesterday. In fact, the volume leader yesterday was the March 4,000 call. Yeah, the 4,000 strike call, 8,300 of those traded. Volatility down quite a bit today. In fact, the vol Q down about 6% today, down to around 26 and a half or so, the lowest it's been in about a week. ES Options pricing in a move of about $28 tomorrow in the S&Ps and about $85 going out to next Friday. Bitcoin, it is teetering on the brink of breaking out to all-time highs. Did trade a high of 58000 today. CME futures volume up a little bit today, about 8,500 contracts. And going out, looking at the June future at the CME for Bitcoin futures, that traded 60000 today.